Redirecting it to take up this whole patch. Cut off the first two female fruit that showed up yesterday. And two weeks later on the hydroponic plant. This one's really spreading out a lot. We got a secondary coming off of the main already. Several flowers that I've clipped. This is where the main vine is headed. So I'm just giving it something to climb up to up here. A lot bigger than that one. Also, still not much on the Nutrients being used. Check in another week or two. Another week later. I'm starting to get some more flowers coming up. Bearing the next few nodes. Uh, I think this is going to be the the pumpkin that's going to get pollinated. It's right on there, so I'm going to kind of let it go this way a little bit and then train it back that way. In the next week or so, I don't know, it'll probably take a week or two. I just gave this bed a whole uh, small feeding granular food a couple days ago. The rain's been helping. So good growth this week. Starting to get a little bit of branching out too. Good stuff. Now let me step back further for this hydro plant because it's officially gotten to the size where I am terrified of it now. It is larger than I am. Uh, growing this plant feels a lot like, I don't know, growing a baby kraken and then watching it go from a little kraken by, day by day, just, you know, growing feet and feet and feet. Here's a side one with a pumpkin on it, a pumpkin flower. Got a male flower there. We've got this one coming up here. I think there was something on it. We're just sprawling out. Added about 10 gallons of nutrient water yesterday. See over here, I'm just giving that a little place to climb onto for this vine so it can start taking up this area. And then the main vine is getting some support to end up growing the pumpkin right about here. So I'm going to train this down to about here, let it set the fruit, and train it back up along this way. Because ultimately, Bonobo needs room to move around. Roots have grown like crazy. I refilled this yesterday, and it's already gone down quite a bit, so we're getting to the stage where it's thirsty, thirsty. I added about 10 gallons of full strength nutrients yesterday of the master blend, so 24 grams of the main fertilizer, 12 grams Epsom salt, and then 
24 grams of calcium nitrate. So these are the real times. This is this is getting serious. I'll check back in in one more week when I'm sure we'll have pollination time.